here's a review on my newest cooling fan the brand is j-u-d-r-t and this is what it looks like this is the box that it came in and these are the features okay um this is the size and reference it is um it's a good size it's not too um big but also it is um larger than um some of the cooling fans that are out there so it is now off it does have a rounded c charger and to turn it on you're going to have to hold it and it starts to glow now i have had mine now for over a week and i run it constantly it's hot i'm in florida and we definitely need it i have two of them and this one right here um, runs the most and here are the settings so um there's a blue light that comes on but the blue light has now stopped working um so right now it's on the lowest speed okay this is the second speed this is a third speed so i use the third speed a lot and um, the first speed a lot so that's why the light has already gone out and this is the fourth speed so you can hear it blowing and there's a slider okay and then there's a drip pan down here so this right here is going to collect your condensation your um the it, it it drips a little bit from where it produces the cool air and it's going to be in here now you do want to make sure that you maintain this and watch out for it because if you continually refill your fan and your drip pan gets full down here it will leak out on your table or what have you it does have a timer and you have a two hour four hour six hour eight hour timer um i usually use the two hour timer um if i'm like going out or something like that or if i put it on right before bed and it does it shuts off and then it'll just give you the red light at the um end of the timer going off now you do have two cool settings um, in the instructions, it wasn't too clear on which mode was the um, coolest. But this first mode right here, with the most parts to the icicle, is your highest mode. And then the second icicle is your smallest or your not so uh, blasty mode. You also have the light. Let me show you the light. The light is very much a night light and it does cycle through the colors. Now on the box it says, on. on the box it says it like, it says colorful atmosphere lamp. It kind of says it like you can choose, but I haven't been able to choose the color um, that I want the night light to be. It kind of just cycles through the lights see that I actually like this at night um, because it does give like a warm calming feeling and you just don't have to have it on that's another thing that I like that you can just turn the light off it's very easy now to turn it off you're going to hold it again and then it'll go off and then it'll be red right here now when you turn it on again it will start back at the lowest setting it kind of does like an adjustment and then it'll go really low and then this will be your first fan setting now to turn on the cooling section when you run out of water in your reservoir the cooling will turn off and then it will automatically just be a fan so let me show you there's a twist at the top and inside is the compartment that holds the water there's no water in here right now but let me turn it up and you can see how it's not set 
but the last time I used it, I had the cooling um, part on. So I'm gonna take my water, okay? And you can use ice too, but make sure you use ice and water because just the ice, for some reason, it will fill up your reservoir very, very fast. Okay, so that's our water, let's put our lid on. And just like that, our cooling mode is automatically on. Okay, let's turn it up. You can kind of hear it frosting a little bit. And you can't really see it on the video, but you can see, depending on how it is in um, your house or in your environment, you, if it's warm, you can definitely see how the air is much cooler from the um, whatever the temperature is in your room. I do have a little bit of water buildup right there just from using it a lot, if you can see. Um, so that's something to take in consideration. You do want to clean um, these little spots down here um, on your pan so that you won't have buildup. Okay, this is low. Well, nope, that's all. This is low. Okay, it's not loud at all either. And then that's, that's back to high. Trying to get it focused. It's not loud at all. But I really, really like this cooling fan. I do have the, um, the Arctic fan. I might do like a little comparison um, on the two of them side by side. Um, I don't know. I probably need to get a tool to see which one uh, blows the coolest. But I really think that they do go head to head on um, competition on how well that they both do. But this is a definite... Um, want to get i have another one right here hold on here's my second one running and as you can see it is very very quiet i was trying to get where you can see um there's no water in here hold on all right let's put some water in here you can hear it automatically shut on with the smallest amount of water and I'm trying to see if I can actually catch some of the cool coming off of the fan. Let's see here. Very hard to catch it to um, see it. But please believe me, I give this a 10 out of 10. It's an awesome cooling fan. It does make a great difference in your space especially a small space, a medium space just as well, um, but just to blow in a certain direction to cool that area, um, I would really recommend this cooling fan. I love it so much.